जगदीश सुधीश भवेश विभो परमेश परात पर भूत पिता प्रणतम पति हत बुद्धि बलम जन तारण तारयता पिता Hello everyone, I am Arvind from Ignite IAS, pursuing intermediate first year MEC. I am here to explain about the bronze sculpture of Nataraja which is installed at the entrance of Bharat Mandapam for G20 summit in India. The 18th G20 summit was successfully conducted at Bharat Mandapam during 9th and 10th September for 2023. Why is the G20's presidency is important to India? India's G20 presidency with representation from world's most powerful countries accounting 85% of global GDP and 75% of global exports has provided a platform for international economic corporation and also an opportunity for India. The G20 in 2023 will focus on the theme One Earth, One Family, One Future. And Honorable Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi inaugurated an international exhibition cum convectional center Bharat Mandapam. The project has a total build up area of 4.2 million square feet compressing an iconic world class convectional center that can accommodate 7000 people in a single format. Six modern exhibition hall with an area of 1.5 lakh square feet. The 27 feet tall Nataraja statue is designed by Radha Krishna Stapati, bought from Tamil Nadu and installed at the entrance of Bharat Mandapam. The idol is of Ashtadhatu, it means 8 metals, a mixture of copper, zinc, lead, tin, silver, gold, iron, mercury. The, it is a bronze sculpture of Lord Shiva in Nataraja posture Tandava form. It features a upper right hand of Shiva holds drum which indicates sound, upper left hand holds fire which indicates destruction, the lower right hand is raised in the gesture of Abhaya Mudra, lower left hand is pointed towards the foot. Shiva is standing on the draft which symbolizes ego and ignorance of an individual. The Lord Shiva is in the form of Ardhanarishwara. Displaying the statue at the G20 summit venue is one of the greatest recognition for Bharatanatyam as Nataraja symbolizes Shiva as Lord of Dance and Dramatic Arts. Thank you. Jai Hind. Jai Bharat.